Hello, this is a hand make uh, magnetic generator. Uh, the last two video, they separate and now uh, a two uh, unit. Now I combine to one unit. And this is the little gen uh, motor that powered by the 12 volt battery that can power the whole uh, seven generator. You have three on the bottom. Okay, each one is six kilowatt. Okay, you can verify that with uh, the name of the company right there. And on the top, there is four generator. One, two, three, four. And you have two flywheel that drive the two generator. Same thing. And the, and on the bottom, you're going to see the two flywheel. Big one, which is power. This two flywheel. So you got four total flywheel, seven generator. And they are touchless, if you can see it. Okay. And this is a rectifier. It converts AC three phase to a DC. And this is all the meter. This is, you can see, and you can see the motor right there. And this is a battery. Okay, I'm gonna turn it up. And this is the to power, increase the RPM from here. As you can see, this one, I got to DC, you see that's 56 volt, you see DC. Yeah, so basically if you want to increase the power, the output, all you have to do is increase the RPM that would raise you the volt and the amperage. On this side, I hook it up to this is a three phase uh, AC, one of the phase. So AC got three phase coming out. So you can see right here, three phase. See, and all you have to do is just increase the RPM, see, and then go up. That's when the volt come in. But later on, you're gonna have an automatic voltage regulator. That's how they control the volt. In the back, you can see one of the back one of the back generator. That's all. Up and down is just how you control it. I'm only going a little bit. Uh, you can see. See that four of them running? They are touchless. And like I said, it's wobbling because like I said, hey mate, this is just to prove the technology is in here. So it's the same thing. You can do with the gas generator. Take a look. This is a gas power only by one generator. If you put the flywheel in between those two, you can as many as generators you want. So you don't have to buy big one or more by just using one gas generator. But but if you're in the middle of forest, you know when you what are you gonna do when you run out of gas? So this is from little motor. You can crank up seven, but you can do as many generators as you want because it, they are frictionless. They do not use bell or gear, as you can see. Everything touchless, frictionless. So the more power it go, the more powerful magnetic field is. Okay, and this is seventy-seven volt. Think about it. You have four generator times by four. But I can crank it up, it can go 200 volt, but that's very dangerous, you know, DC. And like I said, over here, DC. Okay. You can see it. So, you can get infinity powers as long as you just add the generator and the flywheel. Because the flywheel is powerful that we pull two generator. Actually, you can pull generate behind this one more and they still have the power to do it because since I do by hand it, you can see it's a wobbling you know what I mean but uh, so when the machine shop come it's gonna run twice as bad than this but this is already give you enough powers already so <clears throat> instead of using coal we can turn this into magnetic field we never have to buy any fuels again
Okay. <clears throat> See again. 78 volt. I can crank it up. Go higher. Okay. But I don't want to. He's shaking a lot now. See, in the back is 100 volt. I got a bad going down. Now, RPM. The more you increase the RPM, the voltage going up and the amperage. This is not a. What do you think is a transformer? Convert from, uh, you know, small voltage to high voltage, but then you lose the amp. Okay, this is totally different. Okay, this is a generator. 